like 20 minutes to film two videos and of course it's <clears throat> the long guys are outside like making the most crazy noise like with their blowers of course hi everybody welcome back to a glittery life well i have some favorites for you some weekly favorites I wasn't sure I was going to do any weekly favorites, any glitter reports in December because I'm really trying to put together my best of 2015 products. But since I have some products that have been real standouts this week, I'm definitely going to do it and tell you about them. Um, first off, I'm going to talk to you about what's on my lips. This isn't a favorite, but I love it. It's not a weekly favorite. It's kind of a favorite all the time. This is Charlotte Tilbury Love Liberty. It's one of their uh, matte revolution lipsticks. Really pretty berry color and definitely looks darker in the tube than I feel like it reads on my face. So that's a pretty one. I'll link it down below. Okay, so a couple things for my face that I've really been loving this week. This is new to me. I just had it this week. This is the Radical Skincare Youth Infusion Serum. You know me. I'm all about skincare. I'm all about, like, anti-aging. And um, this is my first time using anything from this brand. I've been using this serum and then their um, pads, their face pads. And so far I'm pretty impressed but I love this serum I love the way it feels it's morning and night I've used it for I guess nine days now eight days now eight or nine days and I don't know I feel like my skin has like such a pretty like glow to it this week this brand was kind enough to do a discount code for you guys too so I'm gonna link that down below if you want to try them they're on Sephora but I think if you go through the website you can actually use the discount um, you're going to probably hear me talking a little bit more about this brand because this is one of the skincare. talking a little bit more about this brand in the future because it's one of the skincare brands that I'm trying for 2016. You know I love a whole line, like a whole regime from the same line. So this is one of the new ones that I'm going to be trying. One of the things that I love about this brand is that it started by two sisters. So that actually is just a little tidbit for you. It doesn't have anything to do with the product, but I like a good, I like to know the back, the back story of a brand. So anyway, I definitely feel like this has been affecting my skin. It's only been like a, over just over a week so we'll see I will report back after a month using this but like I said I'll link a discount code for you down below something else that I am obsessed with that I just got this week is the Youngblood liquid mineral foundation deep sea hydrating complex and this is the color sand and I was afraid that it was going to be too yellow for me but the other ones just none of the shades looked quite right for me when I looked at it online I have it on today. I've worn it every single day since I got it because I think it is so beautiful. I mean, you tell me what you think about the finish of my foundation and about what you think my skin looks like, but honestly, it melts into your skin. I don't, I've never used this brand before. This is my first time using this brand. Um, paraben free, rich in ocean minerals and nutrients. Creamy makeup provides a moisture with a lasting radiant finish for sure. One, it's long wear. Two, it has such a radiant finish, but not oily, not greasy. I gotta be honest, I don't know if it's this like combination or what. I'm obsessed with how my skin has looked this week and I don't always feel that way. A lot of times with foundation, I'm like, eh, but I am seriously into this foundation right now. So on top of this, like my skin obsession this week has definitely been Lightscape, Lightscapade, sorry, Lightscapade. You guys fully convinced me to keep this. I was totally all set to take this back. This is what I have on today. I love that a lot of you are like, it's a really subtle like highlight. Well, truly any highlight is subtle depending on how you use it. But girl, I was like, like layering this thing up because it is the most beautiful pearly glow ever. And now I know that um, Becca Pearl is launching and all that kind of stuff, but girl, look at that highlight. You need that. The cool thing about this is that it has a blue undertone, so it is a cool toned highlight. And I know that's weird because we don't really think about highlights as far as being cool, neutral, or warm tone, but this is a cool toned highlight, which I find is really hard to find. It's also got some like cool yellow gold in it, not like icky yellow, but like a really pretty gold, like a cool tone gold. Honestly, I cannot believe I waited so long to have this and I put all the rest of my highlights away right now because this is my jam. Uh, a couple other things that I cannot stop using. 
<clears throat> this is the uh, Art Cien Manuka Monster Pressed Pigment, whatever, in Heaven. I don't have this on today. This is the first day that I haven't worn it. Look at that beautiful gold. I have been packing this all over my lids like I can't stop. Can't stop, won't stop. It's so pretty. It's really like, it's, it's hard to describe this color because sometimes it looks a little bit like yellow. Sometimes it looks a little bit silver. It's just like a bomb shadow. Oh, you, and that's like one swipe. Look at, okay, so that's one swipe. And look at all the product that's still left on my finger. That's how we know it's mega pigmented. It's when you do a swatch and you still have this much product. I mean, that's crazy. You need these. If you don't have these, you need them. I'm gonna link them down below. And then I have to give mega shout out to Wayne Goss's holiday brush. I did a whole video on this brush. I'll link it down below in case you didn't see it. I feel like a lot of you missed that video. Oh my gosh, this brush is the nicest powder brush, the nicest finishing brush I've ever used. It's so beautiful. I have been setting my makeup every single day with this. I love it. There's never, I, I just, oh my gosh, I love it. It will be a favorite probably for the rest of my life because that's how long I'm gonna have this baby because it is not cheap. So anyway, if you missed this, I'm so sorry. If, if there's even a chance that it's still available, I will link it down below so that you can get your hands on it. I don't know, I don't know. At the point that I'm filming this video, I don't know if it's still available, so mwah, 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 mwah. I love it. Anyway, those are my, that's my glitter report. Those are my weekly favorites. Um, I don't know about you, but I am so, I have to just tell you this because I'm so excited. Beautylish is not, is launching Natasha Denona. It's, Natasha Denona is the brand that everybody's talking about and it's from Israel and it's like kind of hard to get and you can't get it anywhere in the States. They're launching it, but they're launching it worldwide. So places that Israel can't ship to, you'll be able to order from Beautylish to get Natasha Denona. Denona. I'm going to be in San Francisco all next week for the launch. So you might, some of you might actually get to talk to me because um, I'll be helping people figure out what to order and all that kind of stuff. But anyway, I, you guys, I'm so excited. So anyway, you guys, thanks so much for watching. If you haven't subscribed yet, hit that button. Send me a little Christmas present by hitting that subscribe button. Thumbs up this video if you are even have started your Christmas shopping. I am proud to say that I am totally done. All my packages have been mailed out. I have never been so on the ball. But anyway, love you guys. Have a great day. Bye.